Happy Valentine's Day, everyone. This is your Black Knight. And because GTA doesn't really give us a lot of opportunities to somehow celebrate St. Valentine, Bishop and Martyr, we're going to go for the more romantic aspects of the holiday. The, the more commercial, the more taking your, your gal out on a, a date for, for Valentine's Day. If you're going to try and impress a gal, why not dress like you've just come back from Cayo Perico? You know your way around. You've just your, your pockets are flush full of money. You should go for him. You look hot tonight. Don't take less than a hundred. Call me when you're through. Take care of you. Take care of you. Work it. Work it, baby. Work it. Work it. Own it. Chocolates in the trunk along with the flowers. You know what I'm saying? And Life, uh, finds a way. It floats back to you. You can see I have, wow, what color glasses are these? The, I have uh, my old St. Valentine's Day special. And certainly this is still a perfectly wonderful car for, you know, a romantic getaway but not a lot of room for spontaneity so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get another car as one has just been av made available the classic Broadway for nine hundred and twenty five thousand dollars let's face it so far the future has been a disappointment we were promised commercial space travel and world peace. What we got was increasingly weird VR porn, and everything else pretty much sucked. So why not buckle into the Broadway and head right back to a time before Rule 34 existed and futuristic design was still utopian sci-fi rather than doomsday cheek. Boy, there's a lot of truth to that, really. Wow. That's that's a bit heavy. Uh, wow, they're... There's some thought way into this one. Okay, let's order it. Let's put it in the agency. I have thought a lot about what I was going to do with this. I mean, I was going to make it, you know, chocolate brown for, you know, I mean, we still do that. We'll have to look at how it looks as like a bonbon. I could do what everyone will do for this is try to set up with the, the red that goes with the, uh, the Valentine's Day livery, which, by the way, you can you, you, there is a Valentine's lover's livery that comes with this, which is drip-fed, available on the 24th. What is the point? Who is going to be running, like, the holiday stuff after the holiday's over? The only reason you'd have this livery is for Valentine's Day, and you're watching this on Valentine's Day, and it's not available yet. No, no, you have to wait till the 24th, per the newswire. That's just wow wow rockstar you're addicted to the drip feed man i mean all you would have to do is make it available to everybody no matter when you get it do, do, do you have to make it like a limited why is everything fomo why is everything fear of missing out it's it's a livery why are you doing this why are you making everyone crazy there's no point to making everyone crazy I mean, let's just think it's selling shower cards, but I mean, come on, guys. You're, you're making enough even without that. I mean, you've made billions. Literally billions. Uh, with the B. <sighs> kind of, this, this color does kind of match my outfit. That's kind of interesting. Okay, we're, we're probably not going to keep the red and orange. Now, I thought... I thought several ideas here. Like... It'd be nice if you could make this a convertible, but I don't think that's... Is there a roof option? Roof accessories. You got the vintage swamp cooler and the retro swamp cooler. I'm thinking retro swamp cooler. Sure, let's, let's go with some kind of air conditioning. But, see then, you could get right to the re... Let's see, you go right to the respray. And let's see, we're in the yellows. Can we get a really pale yellow? You can't do a really pale yellow. Do yellow. 
Goo Yellow is probably about as close as you could get. And then you're kind of, it's a Karate Kid kind of reference, you know, with the whole... But no, we're not going to do that, I don't think. That's... Bronze? Is bronze the look of love? No, what's... Pink? No, nah, you know, pink, the pink, all these pinks, those are just too obviously Valentine's Day. Candy red, though. You know, candy pink colors, that is, you know, such a 50s look. Yeah, I'm, I'm leaning that way. I'm leaning that way. I was going to go with more of a burgundy kind of thing. Because that does look good. You know, these Cabernets, sunsets, and all that. But candy is, that's very much the period. And, it's, you know. And then if we go for the second, let's see, what's the pearlescent on this? Pearlescent black. No, we got to light this up. With a cream, maybe? Or ice white? Just make it shiny, or do we want to go with another red? Just to deepen the red, you know? Like, wine red. A little wine over it. Cabernet red. Grace red brightens it up kind of nice. But is that too red? Do we want to go with more like a wine red? Wine over candy. That seems very... It's 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 very much the uh, the holiday, right? Valentine's Day? Now, what are we going to do for the... See, there's, there's your solid candy red. That seems... We don't want to go that way. There's wine reds. We could go wine and candy. Eh! It's not really calling, is it? Let's get up to the browns. There is a chocolate brown. We could go completely meme on this. Chocolate candy! I think we're going with that. I mean, yeah, you could argue that the, you know, the, uh, that a cream or a, a white would look a lot better. But we're going for the memes here, I, if I'm perfectly honest. Uh, let's see. Let's go back up to the top here because obviously we need armor. Body work. Full body trim, but ah, his jaw is falling out here. Oh, it's a full body trim. We're gonna chrome it up. This is for a night out on the town. I mean, this is front bumpers, stock, remove. Okay, that's very clean. That's kind of a round one. Okay, so you got your double bumpers here. Kind of goes well with the, the other chrome. The blade. Ooh, that looks nice. The blade bumper. Roadster bumper. That looks a little funky. Bullets would probably be the that that's like the most traditional. It's bullets on a blade. Looks like still a little chunky. Power ram. The bullets are good. Dig in the blade. Rear bumpers. You should probably match it up. Blades all around. I did hit the button. Yeah, that's, that's looking fine. Engine. Rev, rev it up. No, not one. We want that. We want four. Exhaust. Stock exhaust. Okay, that seems reasonable. That. I uh, know. And no. No. Finned chrome exhaust. That looks too restrictive. I think we're leaving these stock. It's stylish. It's very stylish. Stock fenders, fender covers. Ooh, there you go. Fender covers with trim. Fender covers with full trim. Why would you do partial trim? I mean, that's just. 
hood stock hood hood trim full hood trim and then silliness yeah like like as if you're running this you'd still be running the swamp cooler okay full hood trim there we go again this is standard let's see That's that is an accurate yet annoying horn. Well, let's leave the annoying horn. It does seem unique. There's no um. There's no like Valentine's horns, right? And none, none of those are gonna, you know. Yeah, we'll, we'll stick stock. We'll, lights, uh, neon kits, neon layout, just for the handling, front, back, and sides. Ladies and gentlemen, neon color. Now we could go with a pink on this, just just for the romance. But I, I'm just not. It's not calling to me. I don't think yeah, pony pink. No. It's, Hot pink, red. You could do red lights. Let's leave them white traditional. Actually, the, the white lights might be, uh, or either be the purples or I don't know what's traditional as far as lights. Now I'm open-minded here. Okay, so no, um, no, that completely obviates the, the brown. Ah. Uh, it's, it's good in its own build, not this one. No. No. Let's see, what is deep? Does that obviate the per... Um, deep negative. It, that might add a little something to the brown. Boy, I don't know that it's calling to me. It just, just doesn't seem to go with the rest of the vehicle. OS Customs. Standard pinstriping. Good if it wasn't for the LS Customs on the side, you know? On one side. Black. Rusty, no, no. Beaten hot rod. Alright, now I, I'm gonna tell you, I find this one. Alright, I'm gonna do a taxi build probably at some point, but. Wouldn't it be nice if it was just the decals? Because I mean, all right, then you could do like a red and silver one for that matches the, the the custom one you get from the arena wars. Or you could do blue and what and yellow match the one now at the downtown cap. This is kind of limiting. Probably gonna build one at some point. Fifty. I don't know how far away I'm from fifty on this, but I think we're I think we're walking out of here without liver again. Mirrors, stock mirrors, old school mirrors, retro mirrors. These are the kind of standard. I go old school because they're a little bit bigger. Plate 05 and Neb 312. Yeah, let's, let's go Black Knight on this one. And do we change the color? Yellow and black. I like I like the yellow and blue because that's how the old Pennsylvania tags used to be, so we'll, we'll go with that. We did the respray roof accessory, we did that already. Suspension. I know from Bruffy that it doesn't matter what suspension you put on this, it's all just a matter of how you want it to look. So do we want it as a slam bag? Or do we want it bouncing along like a a comfy cruiser. I'm gonna bounce along with a comfy cruiser. Race transmission. Turbo it. Uh, honestly, that's not gonna make it that fast. Classic visor. Vintage Fulton. 
let's let's say let's the first person here. We need to know what this does. Okay, that doesn't affect your vision. That does. That really affects everything. I hit the wrong button. I think we'll go classic. Oh, or does it look just better smooth? There's a little more texture to here, a little bit more color. If we're going to have this hanging off there, we might as well have the visor, don't you think? That probably would have been a kit. Wheels. Now, I'm going to be perfectly honest with you, because it's a romance special. I was wrongly tempted to go with the dollar rims. But the problem with the lowriders, look how small they look in there. These wheels, you get the white walls and they're bigger. Yeah, we're sticking, we're sticking to the stock. We'll bulletproof them. Tire smoke, we'll leave that alone for the most part. We're going to be Belgian red tire smoke. Tire design, yeah, must be custom. This is just, they are what they are. Windows, light smoke as always. And there we have it. We have a romance special. Let's see how this, how this rolls. Not the quickest. But it does have the right feel, I think, for what it is. It's especially with it up off the ground a little bit with the, st the stock suspension. It has that. Someone's got to turn into you no matter what. It's GTA. It feels right. It feels right for the romance. Romance. Oh, it's a two-door. How? What's the back seat look like? We, we got enough room here. You know, it's vehicle, blah, 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 vehicle doors. Oh. How you doing? Howdy, Brad. Okay, we'll go first person here. Wow, oh, like turned me around instantly. I guess there's a little room. Eh? It, it did be cozy. A little bit more room than the Pagali, but not. Yeah, you're, you're going to be up in the front seat. Don't hit the shifter. Interesting that it's decked out as a manual, very specifically. Three-pedal manual. Oh, let's see. The back, that's 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 held on by magic. No no sign. Look at this. No sign of it. Is there a single feather-thin hinge holding that? That's just, wow. A little bizarre. Here at least you can imagine that there's something going through there, but no, it's still, it's still kind of magical. Clearly a resto mod with a modern engine. All right, so let's let's see. Let's uh, let's close the doors up. Done. Uh, A lot, a lot of hydraulics activating there when you see absolutely nothing connected to them, so it's very much just weird magic. Okay, I guess we might as well be doing vehicle builds. We might as well... Well, we can't build a taxi one just yet, can we? Because we haven't unlocked everything on my other character. Hmm. 
That might have to be a special video for its own day. But for Valentine's Day, I mean, I'd love to say let's do some let's do some Valentine's Day racing with this, but it is not gonna end well. We could I mean we could try to I could take it around one of the tracks. What do you think? Duel? Duel's the brightest. It's got, it's got more light to it. Rockstar created. Stunt races. We'll just take it around Duel once. One lap. Confirm settings just to get a feel for it. Do we try to take it up Chiliad? I don't know if this is going up Chiliad. It don't have the horses. Comes up real quick. Boy, that, that swamp cooler really would screw up your vision out of the, the other mirror, wouldn't it? So, you need some kind of air conditioning. Okay, it pushes a little bit. Ooh. Yeah, let's do was you were running out of radius there. Ah, okay, I tapped the uh, brake to try to get it to turn a little bit more. That didn't end well. You gotta just lift and turn and You can't call it nimble, but you can call it, like I said, accurate. This is, it feels as it should. This isn't a car for hustling around duel. And I imagine it's not even one for going up chilly, although we're going to try that now, aren't we? Now. Does it have enough for the loop-de-doop? The loop-de-loop. Loop -de -loop, the super duper looper. I wonder if the super duper looper is still still around. Is that still? Like Hershey. What oh, the first? Looping roller coasters, that's gotta be pushing what? Gotta be more than 50 years old, I would think. I don't think that came about in my lifetime. I think that was beforehand, but you can Google that, I guess. Not a bad car, not not a bad car to drive, but it's a date night car. It's not a racer. Good looking car. Give this the like we normally give it. Let's let's bump out to free mode. Hopefully it doesn't put me in a public session. Because <laughs> that would be what we would call a nightmare. So the only thing left to do with this... My jobs. The Chiliad Hot Loop. That's right. I need a little bit of practice anyway in case I actually do make it into the big race coming up on the 19th of February. 
likely be the largest J-Friend of all time. Pretty much unlimited people. Definitely muscle. Customs on. Now we're not inviting anybody here because this is just giving us suffering probably for the most part. It's still there. The custom Broadway. Can a custom Broadway make it up chilly out? Hey, Toots, you want to go to the top of the mountain? We'll watch the submarine races from the top of the mountain. What do you say, Toots? That's where we're... I don't know if, it, if the whole thing works here. We, I've gone too far to the side anyway, but we made it. I really got. I really got to get that jump down before the 19th. Can you imagine with like you know 100 people hitting that all at once? You could probably bounce off the cars wrecked in the darn water and get across. Hopefully that's not like, you know, something I actually do because things will have been really dicey at that point. So far it feels smooth over this. It doesn't feel darty. It doesn't feel, you know, like it's having any issues. It feels like a nice car. Not a blazing fast car. If you've got this in a G-Fred, you're probably in trouble. And you're probably about to find out how much. Chocolate and candy! Yeah, very controllable. All things considered. Oh, this isn't going well already. Come on. Let's keep our foot in it. Oh, I don't feel good about this. No momentum. Oh man. Come on, baby. Oh, here's where it gets difficult. Oh no, here we go. We dropped the gear. Oh, she hasn't got it. She's so close. I thought you said we're going to watch the submarine races from the top of the moon. I'm working on it, toots. We're not getting anywhere here. What's the other line? I've never even seen. There's supposed to be another line from further down that gets you up. Maybe down that way. Not here. That's not kind of. We're, we're, this, this hill we're not doing anything with. Let's get back to the tracks. Now I'll admit, my, my bruffy uh, research is probably inadequate here because I, mean, I, I don't think he's ever done that other one. At least I've never seen it. I don't even know where you make the turn.
Is it here, maybe? That looks like it has potential if you've got a car with a tractor, but it's just too steep for this thing. Okay, we're going to have to take, you know, the long way up, but, you know, for romance, you go the extra mile. And now you know that I don't know the other way up, so... But you probably could have guessed that. It's only the wrong way if you don't apply yourself, and that's... I'm kinda glad I left the suspension soft. Come on, we're, we gotta go see the submarine races. Anybody get that reference? Come to think of it, this isn't probably too far off of Richie Cunningham's car. His was red. I think his was a convertible, too. Definitely cooler than the DeSoto. Am I just remembering it as a convertible? We'll have to look to put an image up here if we can find it. On the, uh, going up this way, not much of a problem. If you, if you know the OG route, it might be able to do it. You don't get taken out by that one bush slash rock thing that sent me down the hill so many times in the snow for it. Wow, that was almost... Whoa! That was... What happened there? It was showing signs of traction and stuff. And lack thereof, of course. There's a moon out tonight. Wa ha ha ha! So let me in your pants, baby. That's how all those songs were. It was just, you know. I'm just being period correct. Just head up here. Yama. After a night like this, you better hope you get the period. Okay, let's just move up to the. We're almost there. Come on, baby. Come on, let's see. Can't do this little jumpy thing. We have to drive it up. Or can we just fall off the mountain? You know, it was funny. I was thinking, or I'll just fall off the mountain. And then I start to fall off the mountain. I did it twice. Okay, come on now. Kiss it! There we go. Down the mountain. Now we gotta get down. And we gotta go down a very specific way so that we're not utterly wrecked and trapped and re restarting and resetting and all kinds of stuff and prepare for the yeet the yeet is coming oh we've eaten it before we wanted to eat it it's a nice noise Vroom. Nothing. Oh, well, that would have left a mark in real life. That would. 
I thought we were gonna watch the sub. Yeah, we didn't. We didn't pause to watch the submarine race. I'm alone in the car, so really, do you really want to? Never mind. And we're back down. So we get past the train. Well, you know, this is, it's almost kind of a, a given at this point. The rest of it, that was the real question. Can it make it up to the end? Yes, if you follow the path. But you, can't, you can't do a hot lap with it. You can almost do a hot lap with it, but not quite. No, no, we're not quite there, are we? A little more power. I think it's, it's, it's not even so much a traction thing. I think it's just not enough power. This is not a blazing fast car. If you're stuck with it, boy, if you're not, if you're not, if it's not modified, if it's an unmodified one, I don't know if that would make it up. But as it stands, this is fine. It'll go where you need it to go. Going where you need to go. Same goes where you need to go. So now you got me thinking, do I do a rusty build with Rusty Jack? One of those big blower kits. The only problem with that is you know, the whole rusty pun thing has been so overdone. And the car is not that fast. It doesn't justify like this monster motor. Wow! It really does, it really does kick it up, doesn't it? Like, if it was a quicker car, if they made this a top five muscle car, yeah, I'd say it, 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 it kind of would live up to it, but as yeah, it stands, it's just a, it, it's a ride when you're picking up a classy dame, you know what I mean? Like, just thinking you're going to make this jump, probably. Yeah, the, he didn't, didn't like that at all. Okay, you wouldn't want to be jumping a classy dame in this car, you know, that's just... All right, we're just gonna move on. <laughs> I remember Daniels wiped her back when I was in high school. The two radio guys had a character called Jonesy who would come in and pick up his paycheck because his, his job was to erase the eight tracks, man. And suddenly I gotta find the tape I made. I used to record them every morning because they were so funny, man. And on Valentine's Day, as he would say, using a heavy area accent, he'd say, Hey, it's Valentine's Day, man, so eat some candy! If she ain't there, see if her sister's home. All right, I gotta go! <laughs> on that note, I gotta go, ladies and gentlemen. That was on the radio. That was. I was a young lad exposed to all that. And, and you see what kind of effect it's had on me. Oh dear, on that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Happy Valentine's Day. Have a great night. And here's just a quick look. You can see what I mean. Like, if you could just put the taxi livery on this. There's so much more potential. I mean, you know, for, for colors mixed and matched. That'd be awesome. As, as it stands. Like what's going to happen is when I eventually unlock the livery. Pretty much all of that blue goes away. Actually, the fact that I got the secondary is yellow. It doesn't even look like it matches. I guess there's a little blue in the wheel wells. Uh, 
I don't know, is this better? We got options. Okay, that's kind of calling to me. If we're doing that... Let's see, let's fix the plate. Hold on. Track saying, why is the transaction pending so long today? What's this one? Only other thing to consider. Does, does putting muscles on this make them look tiny? It does. Yeah, that's not calling to me. Let's, let's leave them stock. That's funky. 